Hi, it's King Lizard on Xbox One with Forza Horizon 2 Porsche DLC bucket list action. And this is event number seven. So in event number seven, we get to drive Porsche's Turbo S and we have a two tier challenge for this particular event. One is to reach our destination within three minutes. The other is to achieve a 75,000 point skill score before we reach that time checkpoint, three minutes. Now, obviously skill scoring is all about drifting, causing wreckage like driving through these fences and stuff. However, drifting and high speed overtaking near misses are going to be your key to success in this particular challenge. You do really need to make the most of this early technical section in this event because this is where you're going to get the majority of your drifting done. That was close. I nearly took that car there. So, Keeping obviously your skill score racked up and in a timed state is going to be essential to completing this challenge. As you can see there, I've got 42,000 of the 75,000 skill score. However, you also need to keep an emphasis on speed in this particular event. Now the technical section is over, what we have left is a very fast stretch of road. This in fact is an autobahn. So, in order to achieve score on this particular section of the event, you need to drive at very high speed as well as perform near misses. Obviously the more near misses and the better speed that you keep without interruption in your score will result in a bigger score at the end of your chain. Now, as you can see here, I'm up to a 2.2 times score. Obviously, I've got to keep and maintain this top speed that I'm doing in order for that score times to keep building. Now, obviously, if you see a car, do get close to it, do perform an miss, and that also will ensure that you increase your score. So this is quite a tight old race here. As you can see, you can afford to make a mistake I made a mess there. I've still only got 44,000, but I've got 1.9 miles in order to bring that score back that I just lost. So I took a cheeky little drift off the track there. Another near miss. That brings me up to 2.8 times, 3.0 times. So it's going to be tight this one because of the error I made. Without the error, it's doable and it's not too difficult to be honest. But if you make a mistake, obviously you're going to make things a lot harder for yourself like I have in this particular video. However, I've got a five times event there. That's telling me I've got over 35 points. So I've got this event in the bag as long as I don't hit anything or come to an unexpected end. So that's success. So it's not particularly a hard challenge, although some skill is required in order to get it done. So just keep your wits about you, keep your eyes peeled on the road, and you'll be able to pin this baby down in no time. Please remember to rate and subscribe. Take care, keep watching, and come back soon.